Yes, people, the only graph battle that counts. Tempo 33 versus Capo. That's right, we're in Trellick Towers, uh, the home of Graf, West London. And alongside me is Jordan Grant. How are we feeling, my brother? Yes, good? man, very well, thank you. Looking forward to the next battle. New guy in the arena as well, man like Capo. It's mm. very, very good to see. It's great to see. The weather is looking good. It's on our side, no rain. And the same rules as always, though. 12 cans of paint each, a selection of scrap paint, and only three hours to do it in. Big shout out to Global Street Art for the sponsorship of the paint. Um, nice array of colours there, and uh, a most all ready to go. Yeah, fresh and ready to go. Right, Daps, and let's have it, man. Yes, Good. Here we go. So, right. Yes, Capo's going to be moving a lot more fast than he's used to. Yeah, Capo, notorious for, you know, really spending time at a wall, <laughs> really being meticulous with stuff, and I guess that's going to see a different challenge today. You know, speed is of the essence. That's you can right. already see some slightly different letter forms from his typical coming out. Look at that barge into the camera. <laughs> Get out of my way. back in the place. God, he's becoming a bit of a resident in London right now, isn't he? <laughs> that's right. His petrol bills are killing him. <laughs> <laughs> so he, let's see what Temps is pulling out on the pinup. It's looking pretty similar to his previous, but we don't know. That could just be that leather either way. Yeah. It's taking up a good bit of space in top to bottom styles. I love that. Yeah, writers have a way of uh, getting used to the, the letters that they, 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 they do, don't they? Um, it's nice to see Capo doing something a little bit different here. Yeah, trying to build some links, as we can see at the minute. Yep, absolutely. You know, start having a conversation between the letters. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, all the bits and uh, uh, clips that come from Tempo, I, I just love. He's got the formula down straight, hasn't he, and has done for the last few. Yeah, man. The only difference this time around is some real bright colours coming out. It mm. looks like some nice big primaries. I know last time around, yeah, he definitely had his work cut out, just uh, trying to pull out the words from the background. A lot of time and effort went into the backgrounds last time. I wonder if that's going to be the same this. Yeah, totally. And it, it, in fairness, it was one hell of a day last month when we did the battle. It was it was a proper, um, you know, 24-7 affair. And I'm surprised we managed to get the pieces out we did. Um, I'm always finding it impressive how, no matter what the colour schemes that the Global Street Art come with, the, the dynamics of each piece are so different. Yeah, definitely. Do you think they're trying to set you a challenge each time or do you just think they're pulling out what's think, on the shelf? I think they're trying to put, well, a little bit of both to be fair, but they ain't pulling any punches. They, well, they, I'll tell you <laughs> what, they've been keeping these cans warm because the paint is flying out of them. That's all good to see, man. No blockages, yeah. nothing. Totally. And what you're seeing there from Capo is the majority of what he's using there is the scrap paint. Oh, you're joking. No, right, I see a couple right. of comments about that in previous battles. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, but he's using it to the max, which is really good because it means that he's his primary colours, he's holding back. Now we've got the barbed wire effect going on here. Hey, look at that. Mm. Capo's use it. usual stylistic approach as well, just a certain way he uses those hands, man. Yeah, you believe that. <laughs> um, and Tempo's coming with two different outline colours. All right, I'll, I'll wait for the look back then, or the yeah. stand back, sorry. Taking cues from Ames and, in the last battle. Right, the spat, yeah, I remember right? that. That was from number four or something, I think. <laughs> yeah, that's right, it. Yeah, anyone else wanting to track back? Go and see the variety of pieces that have gone on over this time. You know, there's a whole load of them by the end. And the number 12. For even real. more. For real. And you know what's crazy is I'm starting to forget how many writers we've actually had. Yeah, bro, it. seriously. And bless <laughs> to all you lot competing and bless to everyone keeping them in, really. Like, yeah. I think that's going to lead to quite an interesting one because we've obviously got Spat and Mir. Mm. And a leaderboard of three all, three wins all. That's right. Um, Temps could still potentially take this and be a three all. He could be the champ. He could end up being crowned and do it all the way through for the next two, three episodes. So. That's right. And oh, look at Capo there now, though. Yeah, that's Just sick. a little something different from his norm. Yeah, for real. He's really got... Ooh. No, I yeah, like that. Yeah, go on, man. I do see the peach speed starting to come into play a little yeah, bit though. <laughs> like yeah, look at those yeah, lines yeah. a little bit. That's anyway, hard. still got border to go on, so that'll be cleaned up. Man, I'm like I've, I've said it before on the show. I'm always impressed with the the level of, of attention to detail, like 3D inwards, different colours. It's, it's, it's right, about it's crazy. man. I love it's it. About. I love it. <laughs> look at this and flipping the script. You see all of that black. <laughs> they just mulched the whole wall, <laughs> and now they've decided to colour it another colour. <laughs> yeah, well, they are going full producky on this one. It's wow. so sick. It's and it feels like they're leaning off each other's ideas there a little bit as well. So they've both gone full dark with paint and they're wasting their main colours. Well, not wasting actually, but they're using their main colours. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, Tim Dunn, look at this. Oh, what do you call that? The Johnny Five cap. The Johnny there. Five cap. This is the new cap that's out, right? Johnny Five Ooh. is alive. Good work, Capo. Yeah, but that's going to like hammer through your oh, paint. Oh, you get through paint so quick. I hope they were low pressure tins, but 
about it. Here's uh, the classic character cover from Capo, and let's remind ourselves there is the uh, the character that Tempo does, the uh, acid face with the brace. Oh, yeah, 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 I heard about that, man. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's interesting, they're, they're two characterful uh, writers, you know, they, they're, they, they're well-rounded in, in all areas of graph. Well, just as well would it be in a battle scenario, we need all angles and elements covered, really. Yeah, for real. And, um, yeah, it looks like there's some full production level thoughts going on already, you know, yeah. I don't imagine we'll just be leaving it as a blue and a back background yeah. like that, so... That's could they be putting in as much effort? Maybe that's why they're rushing through their pieces, because it feels like maybe more effort is going to be put into the background. Yeah, they're definitely two characters that are rivaling each other right now. I mean, the pressure in the place was crazy. And as we were doing it, more writers were coming in to check it out, which was awesome. It was great yeah, it's a good advice. hangout spot, but I imagine with a uh, comp like this, that could create a bit of extra pressure. Man, these two are bolting through it. Yeah, they're both I was just about to compliment Capo on already getting his black outline on. You've got um, Temps just doing his bits as well, already sorting out the white around his. They're powering through it, and it's great to see characters slowly emerging. Some cutbacks going on there. Oh, nice. Love that yeah, brickwork. Yeah, loving the rock there. style doodads, man. Yeah, love that. What is the what? Temp Temps is going real clean, yeah. you know? Almost like a bit artsy, should yeah. we say. <laughs> he knows what he's up against. You know, Capo, he, he flits in between that nice sweet spot of uh, street art and graphic and yeah, really hold it down. clean aesthetic to everything that he does, I have yeah. to say. But not a sign, not a Wu-Tang logo in, in sight. <laughs> <laughs> well, that being said, there's the yellow colour that's uh, synonymous for Wu-Tang. Juan well, Temps is sort of taking heed from his last lessons, last battle learned. Yeah. And um, yeah, I can see there's some flair and some colour going in on top of his letters, but hopefully not too much that it supersedes the piece this time. What is what? going on here? <gasps> Upside down pineapple. Uh, no, it's a, it's a spade. Look, check that down. Uh, I'm like, what is it? Pineapple? Yo, it's <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It's a grave. Oh shit. It's a grave. Sheesh. Ready, dug, fresh, and ready to use, man. <laughs> this is just getting hot. And then he merrily hot. goes goes back to his piece. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't think Tempo's even got a clue what's going on over there. He doesn't yeah. know he's got his own grave being painted. Well, up. he's got his own character rocking now. So yeah. let's see what comes with this. What is that? Going he's considering here. it, he's put some thought into it. Oh, I like that little stubby nose. Is it, is it, what, is it, was it a beer glass? What is that? What is that? <laughs> like, what is this? <laughs> what is this? Oh, right, we know no. that is definitely a gravestone because we've seen the grave. That's Tempo's means to an end in Capo's mind. Wow. So let's see what he hits up on it though. He's pulling no punches on that. Um, there you go, the people are in the building. Yep. Yeah, nice Full house and Trellick. And respect on uh, the train going at the minute. Yeah, various is. names being added there, marks of respect to people. Yes, it's a beautiful thing. Um, it's a it's a mug. It's a cup. It's a ca oh my right. It's yeah, a cappuccino. I can see that now. <laughs> ah, boom, boom, boom. Love it. Right. Okay. Cappuccino. <laughs> the Don Corleone. <laughs> Look at that. I like the uh, the border he's doing. Yeah, on the neon was lovely, man. Yeah, that is fuego. Hey, that's a, a creative character. That's a, that's a wee little cupcake you got there, sir. And what's the white? Oh, yeah, he's got the full that? white Don suit on his yeah. own. Oh, okay, what's this? Oh, that's probably what goes with the cappuccino, yeah. doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He's been very inventive, his, uh, his tempo on this yeah, one. Yeah, he's probably <laughs> having a little quiet chuckle to himself there. Yeah, yeah. I mean, just like... Yeah, so we saw it coming. He's put Tim's there yeah, on the gravestone. Yeah. Lovely hands, though, man. Lovely hands. Man, they ain't pulling it. They are... They're going for it. Yeah, you'd think these guys really, really dislike each other. Disliked each other, right? <laughs> Look at that, and a clear divide between the pieces as well. They've yeah. still gone both fully in on the background, but a lovely clear yeah. divide between... Now nah, this is my space. Yeah. Full production. <laughs> Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> <laughs> God, <Hi>. man. <laughs> so, yeah. Oi, they're all they're doubling up on the characters. characters. Wow. Do they have the same amount of paint as usual yeah. on this? That's what I'm saying. I just can't believe how dynamically different each one of these pieces. I feel are. like so much more is being done than some of the other battles, really. Like right? The paint is stretching. Yeah, it's crazy. It really stretched itself. Even using the black down there, which he did for the grave uh, the grave tomb there, it was like full on black and blowing Wait, out that, that blue. Wait, is that a little knock? They look like mountains of powder, man. <laughs> yeah. Not just ice cream fluff. Oh my God, or look. cappuccino shit, oh, okay. This is the acid face with the brace. I'm impressed. <gasps> Oh wow. yeah, and he's right in the middle of the Kappa character, right? He's munching down. <laughs> right on the fly posting, ripping off the wall. <gasps> oh shit, it's the poster. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. wow. Right, I love that, man. Man, I'm having trouble keeping up. There's so much he's action going, going on in. here. Was there much talk going on <laughs> in the background? No, nah, there what? was nothing going on. To the, They were just on their mission. A lot of bubbles, speech bubbles going everywhere here. 
I'm sitting quietly just watching everything that's going on. This is a like a live play by play, especially with a slightly longer format, Keller. Oh no, sorry about that, guys. No, it's, it's, <laughs> yeah, I think it's, it's just giving us a chance to take everything on. Yeah, so God, much action. What, what's the follow up on this? Go on, let's have a look. You'll know, Don. Yeah, thanks, Keller. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> sorry, yeah, good. Y'all read. <laughs> Here we go. You mug. Wow. Wow. That's mad. That's, that's quite hateful. Yeah, it's hateful. But moreover, it's all very conceptual from Tempo. Can here. we just take a moment to see how Capo's piece has actually developed? Yes. Like, obviously, Temps is doing his thing and it's really, really built nicely, but I did not see any of that coming out on Capo's until now. Not at all. This, is, this, this was a wild card in itself. And yeah, lovely matchup, man. Lovely yeah. matchup. So was Temps feeling confident beforehand? Um... He was. He, okay. He, he, Birmingham don't fuck about. And then Capo's, <laughs> Capo's response. Nice guy. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, that's well funny. Good on you, man. Good on you. <laughs> nice bit of graffers wit there. Oh, okay. Oh, now he's changed up. Say hello to my only friend. Wow. Oh, he tagged the... Yo. Yeah, to be fair. I'm loving everything that's gone on. Let's check out the final ones. Here we go. Here's Capo. Damn, son. Double wow. character. Full mural background. Wow. Crazy letters. And he's Bunky. eating up that acid face with a brace. Oh, I'm really, really liking that. Sick. That's sick. Here's Tempo. Yes, man. All wow. City Star doing his thing. You're no Don. You're a mug. Wow. The competition was really on today, man. Seriously, yeah. they've gone back to back on this. Really. It's incredible. Multiple characters, styles. Leaning Everything. towards other battles they've seen and just trying to do something a little bit different. So One. Here we are. A Capo, B Tempo. You decide who wins. Comment your votes below. Um, the results will be done in a week's time. So make sure you get your comments in and tell us who you think the winner should be. Jordan Grant. It's been a pleasure again. Oh, yeah, I can't wait to see the results on this, mate. <laughs> it's going to be mad. This could seal it. Get voting, people. Easy. Love.